Hey, welcome to the send in. It is Fried Out Friday. Hope everybody's good, doing good. Uh, I know I am ready to uh, smoke my brains out, that's for sure, this weekend. So, I've uh, got a few boxes for you. Uh, some SDCC stuff. Uh, as you all know, it was a shit show. Uh, they've got to fix their e commerce or whatever it is. I was literally there one minute after with two pops nobody wanted. I followed Funko's little tweet, don't refresh, and had people in chat refresh and pass by me and get stuff. I don't get it. But I got one from FYE and one from eBay. And then we got a box from the stash himself, Mr. B Cobb. So uh, this one from FYE, somehow I already gave one of these away. And I didn't open my own on a video. I didn't open it. But I had ordered two because my first order got a gateway error. So I thought it didn't go through. But uh, you know who it is. It's uh, Iron Man. Iron Bob. The ripoff. Good old Kevin Smith. Love this man. He is so talented. There he is inside the suit. When he comes out in the suit, um, Kevin's actually in the scene, too. And he uh, he says, Marvel going to sue somebody. And then he says, I can't wait to see it in Funko Pop form. So he knew this was coming. But I had to get this little trivia, if you didn't know, in uh, Jane Silent Bob reboot. Blunt Man and Chronic. Chronic is played by Supergirl from the CW. And Bluntman is played by Val Kilmer, who played Batman. So you basically have Bluntman vs. Chronic or Batman vs. Supergirl. Whichever way you want to look at it. Now the next one is a eBay purchase. Uh, I had to go after some SDCC pops on eBay. Because, well, I had no other way to get them. At the time. But, yeah, now I could have get them and paid less. Ooh, we got lots of bubble wrap, guys. That's a good sign. Top and bottom, round each. We said they were soft protectors. Yes. So the first one we have is a new set I'm really getting into. Got most of them. The Masters of the Universe new set. We have Blast Attack. Very cool pop, that's for sure, as you can see. And his friend, which would be the other one I got. No, no they didn't take the bubble wrap. Well, this one's actually in a box. And I have now lost my knife. Doo, doo, doo. Funko needs to definitely fix their website. The last two have been total shit shows. I mean, you could be in line at one minute after and still get passed by by people. But the next one we have is Clawful with his little uh, scepter in his hand. Very cool pop. I have all but two on the back, uh, this one and this one. Mosquito and tongue lasher. But yeah. So there we have it. Number 117 and 118 in the television line. And <laughs> these actually came out before the t shirt bundles. Skeletor is actually uh, number 1000 in the television. So lots of office pops and other stuff, obviously. But I had to open B-Cops with it because it goes with those ones. So, hey, Postal Service, you're having such troubles. Uh, this was mailed from Iowa. 
on the first of the month. It made it all the way to me in Michigan and delivered on the third. So yeah. Do we have some stickers? We have the B Cob Stash Hollow foil sticker. Very nice. And then we have the new retro the stash, the stash sticker. With the palm trees, the water behind it, the sunset, the sky. That one's actually really killer, Beacon. You did amazing on these. I believe he's making one more. Set that over there. Now, I have this metallic pop, but I wanted the regular, too. It is web store. Funny thing is, there's now, what, four versions of this pop? There's this version. There's the metallic with the Hot Topic sticker that actually got moved to Walmart. Then there's the Walmart one where they put Walmart stickers on it. And then you have the Overseas Specialty Series stickers. So there's actually four different versions of this pop you could get. But, yeah. That one is cool. Thank you, Mr. B. Cap. Very killer. Like I said, I only need two more now to complete the set. Man, I am fucking blown out. I hope everybody's had a great week. I hope everybody stays safe. Um, all this shit that's going on in the world, I'm going to give you the same advice I did a while back. If it's not yours, don't break it. Don't burn it. Don't mess with it. You want to protest or demonstrate or do it peacefully. <clears throat> do not block traffic. Just do it peacefully. And don't destroy other people's private property. It's not the st local store owner you're mad at. It's not the gas station you're mad at. It's whoever, the government, the police, whatever else you're mad at. It has nothing to do with what you're destroying. Stop it. But that's all I'm going to say on that. Um, hope everybody, like I said, had a great week. If you did anything fun, leave me a comment. Make sure you hit that like. Hit that subscribe. And now let's get on to a little music uh, for rock, metal. We're going to go with a really good actor. And he formed a band with a buddy. Two guys, two guitars. I'm sure some of you can guess, but if you can't, Tenacious D. Uh, this is Jack Black and uh, Tenacious D with, uh, fuck, I can't think of name, Kickapoo. And as you can see in the picture, the little kid just looks like a young Jack Black. Uh, this, so check it out. If you've not heard the song, listen to it. It's got two uh, guest appearances by uh, Meatloaf. And Ronnie James Dio, before he died, rest in peace. Both great artists in their own right. I mean, it's an amazing song. So, yeah, give that one a check out. And the uh, other one for rap, RB. What can we go with? Uh, hey, Harley. <laughs> yeah, that's what we can go with. Uh, going to do an Usher song. Lil Freak. So give that one a listen. Let your ass shake. Let your body move. Forget all the bullshit. Just have a good time tonight. Stay safe. Um, and I will see you all around. Maybe pop into Booze and Pops. So everyone have a great weekend. Like I said, leave a comment. Leave a like. Hit subscribe. And enjoy the pictures at the end. Have a good one.